Trust in the Lord and do good, dwell in the land and enjoy safe pasture. Take delight in the Lord, and He will give you the desires of your heart. Commit your way to the Lord, trust in Him and He will do this. He will make your righteous reward shine like the dawn, your vindication like the noonday sun. Heavenly Father, Creator of all life and everything good. Hear the supplication of your humble children as we gather in unity of spirit and fervor of the heart. In this moment of contemplation and seeking, we lift our eyes to you from whom all blessings flow. With hearts heavy but hopeful, we seek the strength to rise above the trials that cloak our days in shadows. We sometimes find ourselves entangled in the knots of despair and weariness. Yet amidst these trials, your eternal promise echoes through the corridors of our souls. We are reminded that in our weakness, your strength is enough for us to overcome all. But he said to me, my grace is sufficient for you, for power is made perfect in weakness. I will rather boast most gladly of my weaknesses, in order that the power of Christ may dwell with me. Therefore, I am content with weaknesses, insults, hardships, persecutions, and constraints, for the sake of Christ, for when I am weak, then I am strong. In the furnace of our tribulations, where the heat seeks to bend and break our resolve, let us never be driven away from the promise of your love and salvation. We remember your words call on me in the day of trouble, I will deliver you, and you will honor me. This divine invitation to seek your face in times of distress is not merely a call to be heard, but a promise of deliverance, a beacon of hope that illuminates our darkest hours. For the one weighed down by battles unseen, the strife that tears at the fabric of families, or the ailments that besiege the body, we stand united in prayer. With hearts intertwined in faith, we cast our cares upon you, O Lord, for you have pledged to sustain us, to be the immovable rock upon which our lives are anchored, ensuring that the righteous shall not be shaken. You, O Lord, are our refuge, our hiding place in the storms that rage. Around us your melody of deliverance encircles us, a fortress of song that shields our hearts from despair. In the crucible of our troubles, where human strength fades and hope seems but a flickering flame, therein lies the sacred space where we encounter your boundless grace. It is there in the depths of our vulnerability, that we find you, the great I am, the one who is all that we ever need. For when you proclaim to Moses, I am who I am, you revealed your infinite nature, boundless and unfathomable, Exodus 3 14. You are not confined by our earthly constructs nor limited by our understanding. You are the God who delivers, heals, and restores, the shepherd who guides, the father who loves unconditionally. Whatever our need, you are the fulfillment, the answer to every whispered prayer and every tear shed in silence. Therefore let us approach your throne with confidence, not as those who have no hope, but as children of the King who have been promised victory over every trial and tribulation. May we be a testament to your glory, reflecting your light in the midst of darkness, embodying your love in a world fraught with hate. Empower us, O Divine Healer, to be instruments of peace in the chaos. Let us be bearers of joy in times of sorrow, and bringers of love in the indifference. May our lives be a continuous prayer, a living sacrifice, pleasing and acceptable in your sight. As we journey through our brief existence, may we do so with the assurance of your presence, the comfort of your promises, and the unshakable faith that in you, we are more than conquerors. For when we are weak, then we are strong, fortified not by our might but by the power of your endless love. Blessed be your name, O Lord, from this time forth and forevermore. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.